So we try and carry some different sorts of things in the store and uh, I thought I'd take a minute to highlight a couple of the cool things we've got. Um, a lot of people when they walk in the store, they see this sitting on the counter and they think, wow, it's really cool. Some people know what it is and some people don't. So I thought I'd take a minute to explain it. Um, this is an 1873 coffee mill. Uh, it's a number nine. They're numbered based on their sizes. This one's a number nine. It would have been um, general store purpose. This wouldn't have been something you had in your house. It would have just been way too big um, and industrial. So they're designed so that you would have put the coffee uh, beans right in the top. So this lid moves aside. You put the coffee beans in the top. They would crank the handle and out the bottom would come your grinds. So yeah, and it's really cool because this is actually, when you pull the drawer out, you can see it's funneled at the bottom. That's so you can take the coffee grounds and dump them right into the customer's bag. So uh, just, yeah, really neat. Um, I love the colors. This one's been restored some time ago. These are the colors it would have been though. So pretty fancy looking piece. Um, really heavy too, it's cast iron but uh, makes amazing decor. People put them in their houses. Sometimes you see them in coffee shops um, where they're just on display. You could actually use this still. So if you're like really into your coffee and you want to have something that looks really cool to impress your guests with like fresh ground coffee, and you don't want to use like a little electric one, you could put them in this giant industrial general store coffee grinder. So yeah, um, just a really neat looking thing. I'll kind of get a little shot over here for you. And yeah, so that's one of the cool things we got in the store. So I'll try and do some more of these little walkthroughs and show you some other stuff that we've got. Thanks.